All right, continuing our tour of the mortgage process, we're going to talk about funding and pipeline management. And the reason I spend time on things like this is that these are the sorts of things that people who enact policies and expect them to work tend to forget about. You know, so somebody will say, well, the servicers need to refinance all these underwater mortgages. We need to, we need to refinance all the underwater mortgages. And somebody, in order to refinance a mortgage, has to bring money to a settlement table. Uh, that's this you know, funding process. And servicers haven't done that. They may have no procedures in place. They may not know how to do that. They may, so they, they don't have a funding and pipeline management process. And you assume that they've got it when you tell them that they're supposed to refinance people's underwater mortgages. So, sorry for the rant, but um, this, this is, I, th I think that one of the ways in which policymakers can be pretty stupid when they uh, try to design new processes for the mortgage industry is they kind of forget what the old processes are, where they're done, how they're done, why they're important. So, the thing about funding and pipeline management that's important is, at some point, money has to make it to the settlement table. Uh, you can't go to settlement and have the mortgage company not deliver a check. Um, so um, that's a process of actually bring, getting funds for the mortgage. Um, the, and the pipeline management function is what I alluded to this earlier, that you know, at some point the borrower wants a commitment. You know, this is going to be my rate, these are going to be my points, so on. You know, I, I need to know what my mortgage is. Um, sometime later comes settlement. And in the middle, there could come fallout. So it's at this commitment point that the lender really has to get some reliable source of funds so he has to uh, you can you can take out an option or a uh, or an actual commitment but the lender has to get some uh, <coughs> something that says that the, that they'll have uh, they'll actually have money to bring to the settlement table um, but uh, somewhere along the way, there could be fallout. There could be fallout. The loan could be denied. You know, you in the process, you you make the commitment, perhaps before you've assembled all the loan file, and as you assemble the loan file, you find out, oh, this borrower really doesn't qualify, so we have to deny the loan, or the borrower walks away. So the borrower says, hmm you know, I don't really want to buy that house. Or, yes, I want a loan, but I think I want it from somebody else. You know, I, you know rates have fallen, and I'm not interested in that loan anymore. So, um, you know, so those are the sources of fallout. And so pipeline management refers to dealing with, basically dealing with fallout. That is, when the, um, when the lender the mortgage originator obtains a source of funds that they intend to use at settlement and then they have to deal with fallout. Now some of these things maybe they obtain an optional commitment so it's kind of somebody else's problem. You know, so an optional commitment would mean the lender just says nope Guess what? We're not. Uh, we. I don't need that money. Presumably, they have to pay some kind of fee <coughs> to get that commitment or to get out of it. Um, or they get do a get a firm commitment, and then they have to uh, then they have to get work their way out of that firm commitment if there's fallout. So that's a pipeline management function. Uh, it's actually a financially somewhat difficult function because it's hard to predict. Uh, you know, when when the fallout will occur, and also there's a tendency for fallout to occur when you least want it. That is, 
uh, interest rates have declined a little bit and uh, you would love to sell that loan you could maybe sell it at a slightly higher profit than what you thought when you made your commitment uh, but you get that's exactly when you get hit with fallout so it's kind of a tricky interesting problem and it's just something to be aware of uh, that 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 is going on in the background in the uh, mortgage process